Recently I, 23F, went out and I did a full face of Macube my dad, 53 meters, saw my face, and said why, are you wearing so much Macube you don't need that, you want me to give you a tip? Looking at you right now I can see all your pauses, that what you're trying to cover? You don't need that Macube I said no just wanted to wear Macube, and he would not stop talking about it so much, so that I just rushed leaving out the house. I don't know how to feel, and felt uncomfortable being analyzed so much, slightly felt insecure too. TL, doctor, recently I, 23F, went out and I did a full face of Macube my dad, 53 meters, saw my face, and said why, are you wearing so much Macube? The next time he says you want me to give you a tip, say no as quickly as you can, and leave the room. This. Do it every time. If he doesn't ask first, and just jumps in, hit him with something, like I'm not interested in hearing anyone's opinions about my body appearance. And walk away immediately. Remember, you teach people how to treat you. It's not rude, but it is direct. People won't like it. But that's their problem, not yours. I wish I had learned this in my early 20s instead of my 30s. Just ignore him. My uncle is like that with Macube. My friends and like most randos love my Macube. I get compliments and I even get asked to do Macube for weddings. But whoever I wear eyeliner or dark eye should around my uncle he's always like I can't even tell why are you are -E -E -S -S -E open. He's just like old country dude who thinks women should like natural and not wear Macube, but OFC he's fine with Macube when he can't tell it's Macube and likes dyed hair if he can't tell it is dyed etc. Funny cause I never give him opinions on his clothes or hair cause I don't give a flying f asterisk ck how he looks even though I would never dress show he dresses or date anyone who does either lol, almost like it's none of my business. I have no idea why men or anyone else gives a res asterisk 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 about people wearing makeup. Well, most women would hate if their men started wearing makeup. And thus they would easily understand why so many men don't like women wearing makeup. Some people love having opinions they have no business having. Ignore him. Thanks for your opinion, dad. And then go about your day. You're choosing to let him get to you. Don't do that. This is the best reply for all unwanted family or boomer advice. Don't take it personal, and just ignore. Your dad sounds like a jerk. A lot of these posts are suggesting you ignore it, or say something petty in return. I personally always prefer, being straight to the point. You are more likely to get his behavior to change that way. Dad, you are welcome to your opinion, but I don't want to hear it. From this point on if you have any opinion about how I look, good or bad, I don't want to hear it. You can expand on why you feel that way or just leave it at that. Hold him to that in the future. Anytime he comments on your appearance good or bad say please keep that to yourself and then walk away. Leave the house in full kabuki makup next time. If you want to wear makup, wear it proud, and if dad decides to offer an unsolicited opinion interrupt him, your unsolicited opinion is coming through loud and clear dad, but now here's my unsolicited opinion, don't offer unsolicited opinions, because it makes you look like an a-hole, is that how you want to come across dad, as an a-hole, I'm concerned for how others will react to you being an a-hole, you should really work on not being an a-hole. Not sure why you keep acting like an a-hole to people when you don't need to or just tell him to shut the hell up. This is just bad advice considering she's living in his house. There are much better mature and adult ways to handle this. It's 2023 dad, not the 1800s. Good old unsolicited advice from family members. Unless you asked how does it look, you definitely did not ask for his opinion. I would be tempted to say I don't remember asking for your opinion. Next time you see your dad. Why are you wearing so much clothing? It's summer. It's hot. I can see your skin. Is that what you're trying to cover? There's no need for that. Let it all hang free. I can see this backfiring in the worst way. Some fathers only see their daughters as little girls. They don't want you to grow up. They don't want boys to notice you or for you to look sexy. What dear old dad doesn't understand is that the makeup isn't for others, it's for you. It makes you feel good about yourself. 
you can either ignore it, or be blunt next time, and tell him, that any comments, that degrade your choices are not welcome. Dad, you can be my champion of self esteem, but not its destroyer. Your attitude is just telling me that negative comments from men about my choices are an acceptable standard. That's not good enough for me. Be better dad. Very well written. So far this is the best response, if you want your dad to maybe learn something. I'm petty, I'd give him an opinion about himself, that he didn't ask for. Um Feo I'm not laughing at all at your situation, but I genuinely think I could wear full blown geisha makup and my non observant dad would not notice a difference. I did get the frequent dad jokes about holes in my jeans in high school, though. I can relate my dad was always strict on me wearing makup growing up though I'm 30 now, and as I've gotten older he hasn't really cared whether I do or don't. Honestly I strongly feel no guy in general should have a say over how you choose to present herself even another woman for that matter her body is us alone do what makes you feel good. I think some antiquated fathers suddenly become seized with some bizarre hang up when they suddenly see their daughters looking more sophisticated or changed in a way that draws attention. Nonetheless, if he starts on it again, cut him off, tell him he already shared his opinion and the topic is no longer up for discussion. Next time ask him if he's ever done makeup before on himself or others. When he says no, then ask how he can justify giving you tips on it. On the off chance he says yes, ask him details on how he applied it, etc and go from there, because you can easily keep grilling him on technique that he'd likely not know what to say at all. So many people think doing makeup is easy until you talk to them about doing it themselves. But seriously, if it doesn't happen again just tell him how you didn't appreciate a critique you didn't ask for, especially when he has no idea what goes into applying makeup in the first place, and it made you feel bad. He likely doesn't know he made you feel this way. This made me laugh, because when I read the title I was expecting you to be like 13. Never take advice from unqualified people. Also dads have a way of giving unsolicited advice by virtue of entitlement. To do so by being your dad. Don't fight with dad over it no need or point. But calmly thank him and tell him you are experimenting with Macup and you don't need his advice or any negative comments least of all unsolicited in the nicest way possible. If that doesn't work then tell him to shut up and f asterisk 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 off. I know his comments were not appreciated but chances are he thinks you're beautiful without it and doesn't see any reason for you to cover your gorgeous natural face or he might have saw or read a news piece about women feeling pressured to conform and wear makeup to please men. Maybe he wanted you to know that wasn't necessary. You know your father and only you can decide if it was done out of malice or from a place of love. Just say thanks for the tip and continue to do what you want. He's going to have all sorts of opinions and guidance that he believes are helpful advice. You're his child. But as his adult child, that doesn't mean you have to comply. Sometimes the best thing to do is pretend to listen and then do what you want. Are you my sister? Cause we got the same asshole dad. I would say mind your own business rude old fart. I'm grown and can wear or do as I fucking please and don't need to hear any bullshit from you about it. Make sure you're yelling and getting animated, while doing it sometimes he gets the full effect. Then leave promptly as he's stunned and in shock, so you escape any blowback from him. When you're in the car or far enough away block him, or silence your phone till the asshole calms down from his deserved takedown. If you don't want to go full on takedown like that, just say it could be worse and go, full sexy party girl, to get a grand baby for them. That'll shut him up, while you walk away. Obviously, you don't have actually go out to find the baby daddy as it's more about teaching your asshole dad a lesson. Generally when the dumbass says something awful as this just bring up potential grandbabies and that should shut him up quickly on his bullshit. Heck, your mom or other family members may get involved on your side if you try this trick. If your child free hopefully they don't know, so the bluff still works for you. Either way, just know you don't have to put up with his bullshit. You can and should stand up for yourself however you feel like it. Good luck. I mean, you're 23. Maybe if you were 13 he could comment, but you're an adult. You are 23. Go live somewhere else. If that bothers you a fake you live in his house. You don't need to take his advice, but you still gotta respect him, though. 
Just say you don't want his opinion on that matter, if that still bothers you, just move out lol. Maybe he's uncomfortable with how hot you looked. Maybe dad has a funny way of saying, you shouldn't feel the need to wear macup, you're beautiful as is. Your dad sounds judgy and controlling. Tell him to get fucked. He's trying to tell you you're beautiful just the way you are. He didn't do a great job expressing that Zed. IDK maybe you just need to change your foundation some people's makeup looks like a mask. I'll take advice from you when I have any interest in looking like you. For now, I think I'm alright with being the hot one. Tell him that you like how it looks and it makes you feel good. If he can put it down after that, he's just a jerk. Tell him you don't want to hear about it anymore. Don't listen to men's opinions about makeup. We have no idea what we are talking about. Unless they actually do know what they are talking about.